the enemy is going to come. Could be your friends, could be your families. It could be your own self speaking to your own mind that why did you even start this? Ah, it's not going to work. Ah, don't listen. Don't listen. Well, I liked what I saw on Facebook. Um, I liked, I am not a little history about me. I'm not from the medical field. However, I've always wanted to run a business that would impact others. Something that I can feel satisfied and the other person, the other parties will feel satisfied. So I've always done a lot of different businesses. However, when I saw this um, commercial, infomercial, you know, call it me, call it what you may, on Facebook, I was very impressed with um, Dr. Nicole. And um, I said, you know what, let me listen a little bit more. Let me dive in a little bit more to see what this can, you know, how this can really take me to my next step. I was very excited and I was very impressed with the fact that it was simple. It was explained simply. We were able to ask questions. We were able to be ourselves and it was transparent. There was a lot of transparency, which was very, very important. And Dr. Nicole was real. She kept it real and she spoke to the heart, I believe, of everyone, including myself. She spoke to the heart of everyone who was looking for something like this. And um, I, was, I, was, I was very impressed. I embrace challenges. <laughs> <laughs> I embrace challenges. If it's a no, it's a next. That means that's one way it didn't work. So I came in and I'm in to see, okay, what do I need to do next? How can I, what do I need to do so that I can create the success I'm looking for? And I understand that it is in my hands. The knowledge is being, the, the table is spread before me. So what do I, what I choose from um, the meal that I choose, the, the, the hors d'oeuvres, the main course, the dessert, whatever I choose is what I'm going to taste. It's what I'm going to get. It's how I'm going to feel, how my business is going to succeed. And I am not from the nursing industry. I am not from the nursing field. I am just a woman who likes to succeed. And I believe if I have 1% mustard seed faith, 1% of the desire to succeed, then if I get what I need, the, the, the knowledge that I need, the guidance that I need, then I will achieve my goal. I will achieve what I'm, I'm looking for. And what Dr. Nicole was saying was what I, she was speaking the language that I speak on a daily basis. And whatever I do with my kids, I'm like, look, you can create whatever you want to create. It's in you. Who was the first person who did this? Who was the first, and first person who did that? So that is my outlook that's my my mantra that's my daily speech to myself i talk to myself um, i tell folks i'm not crazy i'm just mapping it out you know every day is a new day to achieve what i have set out to achieve so there wasn't really any challenges i'm sorry <laughs> i was like okay how am i gonna do the finances i'm like okay if i need to find a way women make a way and men i'm sorry i'm not leaving you out but women make a way at all times whatever we want we will find a way to make it happen I loved, you know, I accepted this, this request to do this because every person that I listened to had something to share. These were real people and they had something to share that could help me. They spoke and they spoke freely and they were comfortable in sharing like, this is what, you know, this is how I came in. This is what I changed. This is what I, I, I you know, this is what I did. This is what I was looking for. And that, that really helped. In particular, in the beginning, I really got excited about the music. I love music. So the starting of each session really say, okay, now pump it up. Let's get ready. This is about to go down. And that was a huge part of, okay, this is non not, no nonsense. Take the slump off. If you've come on this Zoom with a slump, shake it off because we're going to get to business. So that was number one that I really, really loved. The fact that we entered in with excitement, not excitement to just keep us there. Yeah, you know, it was really intense and it was positioned well. That was important to me. Every second minute hour that we spent, we spent one hour together at each week and it was well spent. We could leave with something. I took a lot of notes and as my journey continues, I'm seeing where Melanie, you can work at your pace. Don't waste time, but you're able to work at your pace 
place. You're able to go revisit certain things you hadn't gotten. You're able to interact with the team. You're able to interact with the other participants to say, okay, this is where I'm at. What do you think? How, how can I move forward? Because for me, the end result is success. So what happens between the beginning and the success is dependent on me. So I have to do what I have to do and engage and make it happen. Okay, my time management skills. I have to tighten that up. I had to tighten that up. It's not an option. I can't be all over the place. I have to be focused. I have to be focused. Again, the third time, I have to be focused. We all have to be focused because before you know it, time runs away and we haven't achieved. We haven't done the homework. We haven't done what we need to do. You know, I've really focused in on my time management. I've focused in on people skills. I mean, we all have people skills. We have to have people skills to want to do a business, but just fine tuning that going back to the basics, you know, Dr. Nicole is an exemplary people skill person, <laughs> exemplary, the team, everyone has to, you know, I've seen where everyone has to really hone in on the people skills, being alert, aware, being in the moment in whatever we're doing. We have to be in the moment so that we can get to the next, to the next and to the next. The coaching team have been well coached. <laughs> this coaching team is the best coaching team. Well coached because, again, we are all empowered by Dr. Nicole. Yes, but we are empowered by the coaching team because they are. I can see where the coaching team wants us to succeed. The coaching team wants us to go to the next. They want us to do what it takes to become the next millionaire. But they're also telling us now, remember, it's in your hands coaching us of course in the right way it's in your hands all right how did you do it's in your hands and not feeling as if we are you know they're not intimidating very friendly the coaching team very friendly not intimidating and not letting us feel like we are any less than anyone else there's no stupid questions i am i say i'm the the staffing um firm the for dummies, if, if you may call it that, because I am new, I am green to this industry. But when I come in, I'm not being treated as if, okay, you don't know enough, or we, I am being treated as if, look, the success is in your hands, you can do this. They are motivating, they're encouraging, they are in the moment, I love the fact that we also have a part of the team, alumni of the program, where they are able to tell us, this is your walk, this is my, this was my walk, this is what I recommend, but you don't have to do this, but you know, just a little encouragement, or maybe you should look in this direction, maybe you should look in that direction. Very patient, very patient, I need the patience, very patient. Sometimes my homework is number 10 before number two. So, you know, they have been very, very patient, very encouraging, very empowering, and they have been there. They have been there. Where, where do I find myself? I am so green. I am, <laughs> but green is good. Green means money. So I am um, structuring, I've, I've established the name of my, my business. I've established the, um, the name of my staffing firm. I've established my, you know, EIN numbers. I'm working with the state, going through legal, you know, I'm at insurance, I'm doing that. So I'm going in now into, I'm working on the, you know, branding, if you may. And I'm working on going into finalizing all state requirements, all finalizing all state requirements. So that's where I'm at. My goals, yes. Oh boy, my goals to really launch, really launch 100%. Um, September, I had said August, but I'm seeing where September is more realistic. So it's always okay to rearrange the goals we set because we have to be realistic and, and not really be down on ourselves when we don't actually meet that goal. So where I'm looking for September and I'm looking for the niches, the RNs, LPNs and nurses aides and, um, you know, we have a lot of facilities within my 50 mile radius, 60 mile radius. So when I did my Indeed, it was amazing what I saw. It was like 4,000 CNAs. I'm like, okay, that was CNAs only. So when I did my numbers, I said, you know what? The million is not far away. The million is not far away. It just needs the consistency. It needs my um, focus, my determination, and it needs me to just go out and do the legwork. Follow the plan as the course has set forth. Follow the plan. And I I will be able to make that million dollars in the first year.
Okay, I would say, all right, get dressed. Get dressed and what you're going to get dressed in, determination. Get dressed in focus. Get dressed in a passion, your passion. Because passion can convert to money. Passion can convert to success. You cannot have passion without determination, without the desire to really make this happen. So as passionate and excited as we can be about a million dollars, the the work ethics have to be there. You have the raw passion. Get disciplined. Stick with it. Stick with it. Take your baby steps, but not too much of a baby step too long. But one day at a time, one step at a time, I always say, and I'm not the one that created this. And I think I heard Dr. Nicole with it. You can eat the elephant one bite at a time. And this is, may seem like an elephant when you start to dig in, dig in, but it can be eaten one buy it at a time. The million dollars is there, but it's one dollar at a time, one phone call at a time, one interview at a time, whatever the structure is, just do the, just follow the structure one step at a time. And, and, um, just, just go ahead and do it. If, if you are watching this and you have a desire to do this, the only way you can do it is if you start. The only way you can do it if it's your, if if you start. It doesn't matter where you're from. It doesn't matter the language you speak. As you can hear my accent, I have an accent. And it doesn't even matter. Money has no accent and it doesn't matter where you're from. So, you know, getting that mindset, creating the mindset that I'm going to do this and I'm going to succeed is all you need. So go ahead and get started. Just get started. I want to just share this with anyone that's watching this. Remember, the enemy is going to come. It could be your friends, could be your families. It could be your own self speaking to your own mind that why did you even start this? Ah, uh, it's not going to work. Ah, uh, don't listen. Don't listen. Don't listen. Go, do not listen to the negative voices in your head, the negative voices around you, the negative voices. Don't listen. Go ahead and just start. Take it at your pace. There are stories you can watch. So many other people who started may have. Just wa- just follow the instructions given and you will succeed. Thank you again. Thank you so much.